All right, no cooling. This is a new customer. We have not been to this house before, so no idea what's here. Let's go find out. Yep, heard the death buzz as soon as she turned it on. So, it's probably going to be capacitor one million. One million and one. Got some fast moving spiders there. He was jumping around. I don't think he's going to be happy when I tear up his. That was one of them old cricket spiders. Land crickets or whatever you call them things. This is not original. It ain't fitting in the bracket good so let's go ahead and do this so what happens is these things are so tight on the screw Do a little bending and wedging on them to get the nut driver to go on there. You can see how fat this uh, eight and one, how fat that nut driver is. It's a lot fatter than a just straight up quarter inch is. those brackets I really like. Ow! Ow! <laughs> Psych! I know y'all are just waiting for me to get hit by one of these. Alright. 80 by 5. Good lord, look at that. Believe it or not, I think I got one, but I got an 80 by something. So we may have to get creative here. All right. Common and fan. Four point forty six common and hermetic one point zero three four up and down back and forth nothing all right so as long as the compressor's good a new 80 should fire this thing back up well that's a big old I can't believe this thing takes an 80 One of these dadgum improperly zoned houses. Mm. Let's go see if we got one. Okay, we interrupt this video to do another nest test. Now, I was told that these things float. I 
uh, obviously myth not busted. It don't float, it sinks. Stay tuned for the next nest test. Actually, when I picked it up, it lit back up and the green light started flashing on the top. Now it's been underwater in the mud. So are these things waterproof? They might not float. And they might not swim. But it looks like they sink and still work. Needs to shut down in order to recharge its battery. <laughs> Look at that. Y'all saw me throw this thing in the pond. Restarting back in a bit. I'm going to keep that thing, see if it works. Okay, so in the USA's, which is mostly all I've got anymore, because that's all I'm buying now, I only had an 80 by 7.5. This last, I bet I only had three or four imports left and only 80 by 5 I had is an import so rather than have to stack them up and go through all that I'm going to put this imported Yamasaki on here. So I'm put these two yellows on common. Put the blue on hermetic. Hermetic, hermetic. Hermetic, as our old buddy John Israel says. But we all know what he means when he says it. And the brown is fan. A little bit loose in this one too. Dad, gum it. Somebody done stretch this bracket out. Let's see if she fires up. Okay. Cross your fingers. I heard a compressor. Boy, I feel hot air up here already. It's getting real hot. Okay. So, I already know that I'm not going to do anything else on this job. So, like I said, I already know I'm not going to do anything else on this job, but I'm going to go ahead and go through the motions and ask them. And, uh, 
let them know where we're at and it's back up and running. If they want anything else done, I certainly will. But I can tell you that's all they want. <laughs>